Hello everybody, welcome back to the shop. Alright, we got her fitted in there. Now. Okay, here's my issue. Ollie, this is for you. I hope I catch you before you leave. These were spot welded in place, okay? I could not slide them back and forth. I had to move the, my mount, the turbine, forward just a little bit more than I had planned for all this to work out. What this gives us is a gap that's an inch and three quarters. Okay, is that going to be too much? I already got these holes drilled here. I mean, it ain't no big deal. I could plug them with some dowel and slide it back to three quarters of an inch. Or will this be okay? I'm thinking that would probably be fine. I don't see where it would hurt nothing. But uh, I don't know. I could be wrong, you know. Another thing in the instruction book, Ollie. It says it's absolutely vital that the internal caro plug is mounted straight up. How do we know where that internal caro is? Uh, it's not marked. Nowhere. So I don't. I don't know, man. Uh. I think I got it straight up. I mean, you can see all the plugs. I think I've got it right. These little dillies are pointing straight up. <laughs> I think that's probably good. I don't, but I don't know for sure, man. Uh, it says it could cause damage if it ain't right. But I couldn't go upside down. And you'd have to be able to get to all them plugs, right? So that would be my guess. Uh, let me know on this gap because I could I could I could put some dowel where I got these holes and move that no problem um, just uh, would like to have it ready when we got there you know what I mean I want to plug in that receiver and go buddy so let me know what you think I hope I catch you before you get on that airplane and I want to keep rolling and we're going to roll in Tuesday on your birthday. So happy birthday, buddy. And we'll see you in Kentucky soon.